We're here at the Wind, which is going to be the site for our very exciting RHS community garden project. And what we're going to see here are three gardens created. One will be focused around biodiversity to really give a sense of how to encourage wildlife into your garden. Then we're going to have an allotment growing your own in the town centre itself. And thirdly, a fantastic show garden to really inspire us all how to create great gardens. We've just launched the project and we wanted to celebrate that by having a very special event in the town itself. And so at Sparella Ballroom we had over 150 people from Letchworth and the surrounding area to come and hear from TV gardener David Dominey who was able to share and inspire us all in what we can really do by adopting great community gardening projects. Also the RHS themselves are there. The RHS, an internationally renowned charity, were there to share their experiences and we heard a lot from them to also learn about community gardening projects. The community garden that we're building at the heart of, the, of Letchworth is going to be something that actually grows. Um, there are many projects and uh, ways in which we're going to support the community to build their skills and confidence in gardening, to involve young people, um, you know, elderly, and all of those residents that live in Letchworth that want to get involved. Over the next few months we're going to see the wine transformed into a great community garden and that's something we are all really looking forward to. But to make it a real success we need you to get involved and as David Dominey said it is just a great experience. One of the things about community gardening is much more than just getting your hands dirty and growing plants. It is an immense enjoyment and, and feeling of well-being. It pulls a lot of people together. Uh, and the other thing that's particularly key, it can change social attitudes. It can get kids involved as well as adults and also pensioners too where it shows a great interaction between the generations and, and it can pull a whole community together but it's more than that, it's educational too. What they do in the community garden they can replicate back in their own homes and horticulture and gardening will play much more of an important part of their lives because it's not just all about hard work, it's about digging up and, and eating, it's about entertaining, it's about sharing too. And that's really what community gardening is all about.